This is Twit. It was funny, the day before the keynote, Sunday, John Prosser, Mark Gurman, uh, another Apple rumor guy, all said no new hardware. It was clear somebody from Apple called them one by one and said, <laughs> no, no, but nobody from Apple called them. I was <laughs> There was if it, no, if it was a, if it was a Wall Street, if it were, if it had run in Bloomberg, if it had run in Wall Street, if it had been like BuzzFeed News, like if Walt Mossberg had tweeted it, but uh, let's just say it got out, like it, it, got, it out. got out earlier. That, uh, that I think it was in Apple's interest, though, to say ahead of time, look, this is not going to be about new hardware. Uh, not even Apple tags, <laughs> um, yeah. although there was some Apple tag news, so we'll get we'll get to well, that. There, there was a new Mac Mini, kind of Leo. I mean, it was that was new <laughs> hardware. Yeah, that was. Yeah, you're yeah. right. We right. have a new computer, but you can't buy it. <laughs> <laughs> I, w I actually uh, I, I went over uh, my developer account to see if I could get one because it'd be fun to have. But uh, you have to tell them what app you're going to write with it and all that stuff. And I didn't want to lie. That would just. Do you remember Steve when he's like, when he introduced that cheese grater with the um, with the Pentium chip in it? And he's like, and we're going to want them back. We don't want them floating around out there. Then yeah. we're going to get them back. And that's the same thing with this. You don't own it, you rent it. $500, though, which is not bad. It's part of the Universal App Quick Start program and the developer transition kit. What's interesting is it's an iPad Pro with a little more RAM. Yeah, <laughs> and some different yeah, ports. You know, that too. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's that's. I'm, I'm sure we'll get into it later. But that started me thinking that. So, what's stopping me from being able to install uh, Mac OS on a brand new iPad? You're, uh, you're, 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 you're <laughs> Apple. You're essentially telling me that a lot, most of what I need is already available well, in a Mac. Well, jailbreak in a dream, Andy. A jailbreak in <laughs> yeah. a dream. I do think it's a RAM <laughs> issue, but we'll, we'll get to that. So, uh, the key here, though, is. Um, that they did, and they revealed this later, the whole keynote, all of the Big Sur demos, all of the Mac demos on this. And yeah. it looked perfectly normal. Shades Nobody's, of Intel again, right? Yeah, nobody yep. said, uh, oh, boy, that looks sluggish, none of that. They then later uh, ran uh, <laughs> Maya and Final Cut. They said Final Cut's ready. They said Logic is ready. They showed off Lightroom. Lightroom. Uh, Adobe's been working on it. Shadow of the Tomb Raider, kinda. Yeah, as yeah, <laughs> I have to say, uh, some of that stuff didn't look great. But you know, I mean, this is this isn't even. It was emulated 1080p on, yeah. a, on an iPad chip. Yeah. I mean, this isn't even close to what they're going to release. So yeah, and as we suspected, not one word about not. They didn't mention the ARM word at all. It's Apple Silicon. <laughs> They're moving from uh, Intel to Apple you Silicon. Know, I went back and looked, and Steve Jobs never said x86 or mentioned any instruction sets. He's like, it's Intel, because he knew that was a name everyone would recognize from Wintel's monopoly or duopoly or whatever it was at the time. And it's just that's the marketing term. And I think for Apple, it's a arm, and 90% of the casual viewers would say, what? Like an mm. arm? Yeah. And this is just like, oh, my iPhone and iPad chip. That's great. I love those. I think there's also, also a reason not to say arm, because arm has maybe a bad reputation among people who've tried, for instance, Windows on ARM, it's it's felt sluggish, and I, so I think they just well, don't. It's well, not ARM. It's their not, just, not just that. They make their own chips. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, not, not just that, but it also underscores that this is our own technology. We're not just jumping on this ARM bandwagon. Right. This, we are, it, it, and uh, no one cares what the, what the letters on the chip are. They just care about what do I get from this and why should I not be scared? And I think that Apple uh, really did address both of those during the keynote yesterday. 